Yo, what's up, Jack? Right, and if you're wondering like my mindset through these solos so essentially like, i want every engagement to be as close as possible um even with the milano i can still long range but there comes to like a limit of course because it is a milano it's not like a it's not like a uh like a brand or a bruin or anything like that or a sniper essentially you know i'm wanting to keep my engagements as like mid-range as possible just to kind of keep the consistency of the fights the same. Just so like I'm not having to overcomplicate a lot of my fights. Now, essentially, if some people still don't really understand how solos work. So anytime I kill somebody, there's like a ping on the map. Essentially stating like, okay, that's the guy you just killed. Do you want to kill him again? Yes or no type shit. It's the same thing when you're playing like quads and trios and duos. Um, it essentially will tell you where the person is. But this is essentially solo, so it tells you for that specific thing. Um, I never try to give up the high. I never, ever, ever try to fight high ground in solos because it's really hard to do. Um, especially, like, when you're fighting, like, within the prison. Um, a lot of the time, you're not going to want to fight somebody that's on the second level portion where the other cells are because you may not have a good angle like they do. So, essentially... You don't want to put yourself in the position where you're going to die, you know. That makes more sense, in a sense.
I always try to stay around the prison area just because it's easier for me to like control the pace of the game. Um, you don't want to like try to go over to like Nova or anything. You want to wait until like last minute if you want to go over to Nova, and you want to like figure out like what you want to do, because essentially like if you overstretch, you'll you'll lose out on a lot of like really good kills, or you may die to a kid camping in a building or in a corner. Excuse me. Um, sometimes team wipes have to happen just in order for you to you know keep your momentum going. Some kills are worth to leave, which I do do a lot of the time just because I don't want to end up fucking myself over. Um. Yeah. So far, we're at 22 kill, uh, 22 people left, 21 kills. And just shoot that guy away, kind of like a fly, essentially. Just let him be. I never really like done an in-depth like conversation of how I do solos. Maybe I can make this little video and tell y'all like how I play it and stuff, so you guys can kind of use my analysis for you guys. Um, I will recommend like if you guys do play a lot of prison area while while playing this, you definitely should use those recons because it's one of the most important things to do. I don't know what he just killed me with. Uh, was it the? See, I child with the wrong gun there. I thought he had like a pistol or something, but he had the uh, the new uh, attack rifle. But essentially, um, a lot of the fights which you want to keep is in that range of where I died and I child him at. Um, it's always good to get loady. You don't essentially always have to get loady. If you if your momentum is high with the ground loot guns that you have, you definitely should just keep using the ground loot and just make sure you get like selves and stuff like that if you accidentally died or some shit or uh uavs pumping just make sure you have a lot of money if you end up dying in a really shitty spot you can just immediately like just hit the regain there's always a fire sale in solos so just don't hesitate you know to spend money if you get the opportunity to um i highly recommend getting a bundle ue yourself like this order essentially every time just so you can keep a ue and then pocket one or i I think you get what I'm saying. Like you'll you'll have a UE popped, and then you have one pocketed as well. So, um, so right now I'm just I'm just making my rotations back up to prison because I want to try to get these kills here because there's a lot of kids still up here. And in this situation that people do just laying on you, you just have to kill them. Um, you can't really farm um, kids that are just super aggro when they land back in. As as do I. You know I'm always aggressive when I come back in. I want to get a kill. Um, so now I got 26. So one thing you could do, chat, a lot of the time when you play solos, you're gonna want to grab the most wanted, the big game. Excuse me. Hold on, one second. I'm just getting shot up right now, and I'm hearing a lot of people come in. So I need to. Put him. So this is good. We got 28 right now, 14 up. We still got 40 seconds for the respawns to keep coming. This is a really good spot chat to um to uh, make sure like you can just like drop in on. Um, boom, and then we got the 30 right there. So. Like, you're always just wanting to, like, keep the pace high. Like, whenever you're playing solos, you want to keep a high pace the whole time. You don't want, like, a slow pace the whole time. You want to just keep pushing. Make sure you run quick fix. Don't run EOD double time. I mean, whatever your preference is, but I definitely do think quick fix is very good for solos. Just in case, like, if you absolutely shit on a kid and then you got another kid landing in on you, you don't want them to get, like, an easy kill on you. So now, this is where the, the spawns are done and everything and everybody's going to be spawning back in so you just want to you want to go crazy here um don't over focus focus your looting too much because you don't want to end up like looting to the point where you get caught up and there you go and there's 34 right now we have 34 with 10 up we have a most wanted still up 28 seconds um i'm gonna buy yui real quick and then pop it go to nova real quick and kill these try to kill this kid before the timer runs out um it's almost good to have bounties on you because, like, it kind of gets the engagements up higher. I didn't kill the bounty yet. 11 seconds. Is he in the corner? Yes, he is. And 
They're dead. Okay. So now we have 36 with seven up. We have a kid on the uh, on the boat. Excuse me. I almost said the bus. Showing this kid here. I'm gonna go back inside. Uh, play it up real quick. And then we're gonna keep pushing. To the bottom here. That kid's dead. Okay, and this guy's on the boat. If I don't see him immediately, I'm not gonna chop. Oh, and he snipes me. And that's how I die. Oh, what the f Wow. I'll try this essentially how I play solos in like my mindset. YouTube video. Give a thumbs up.